Hi friends, welcome to Crystal River, Florida. This is a place I've been wanting to visit for so long now because it is one of the only places in Florida that allows you to get in the water and swim with the manatees. There are tons of manatees in Florida and in the winter they all come in here to Crystal River because it's a little bit warmer than the ocean so they just kind of hang out and people come from all around to swim with them and today I've got some family here, I've got my baby here, I've got my husband here and we're gonna go kayaking in the water, see if we can see the manatees and I'm testing out some new video gear, some underwater video gear. We've got the GoPro Hero 6 and also this super cool lens which I will show you exactly how it works so stay tuned. So we're starting our adventure here at the Crystal Isles RV Park. We actually have a little cabin, um, you know, because we don't have an RV quite yet. And my dad's here. You guys remember him from the Florida videos. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you again. <laughs> He's a superstar. And Brian's gonna fly the drone. And my little pumpkin is waking up. Oh, she was taking a nap. Are you in your summer clothes for the first time? Are you in mommy's vlog? Not for the first time. Hi friends. Look at those eyes, you guys. She's the new superstar. Forget about me. We got some rules for the manatees. No chasing or pursuing a manatee. No standing on a manatee. No riding, holding, grabbing, pinching, poking, prodding, or stabbing a manatee. You can't even manage not to pinch and poke and prod the manatee paper. <laughs> she said no feeding the manatees. Right. No pinching the manatees. No. No. Who does Ella look like? I look like my mommy. Ella <laughs> looks like her daddy. Where are we launching? Hunter Spring Park Kayak Launch Location. So we've chosen one of the kayak launch locations. There are many. And apparently it is a 15 minute paddle or kayak into Three Sister Springs, which is like the prettiest manatee viewing area. Although apparently there are manatee just everywhere. And you know, I joke about this, but all this stuff is very important for everyone to go over before they try to visit the manatees in the wild because they are wild animals and they must be respected. Apparently if you just float on the top, the manatee will come up and interact with you if you're lucky. Um, but apparently they do this more in the morning. So we'll see how it goes for us. Hunter Springs Park. All right, so we got a little paid lot. Heavy Bear is blowing up the stand-up paddleboard. I think I'm just gonna ride on that for now. That way I can vlog and we're gonna skip the kayaks. Okay, so for gear on this trip, we have the GoPro Hero 4, my first GoPro, with, this is called a dome lens. Um, now, this basically pushes the water away from the lens of the GoPro, so it gives you this half up, half down shot ability. So I will have to show you, it is super cool. Unfortunately, I don't have one of these yet for the new GoPro, which is the 6, but I will hopefully get one, and I just made a comparison video between the 4 and the 6 to kind of highlight some of the upgrades to the 6, so check that out. And also, if you want to check out any of the accessories that I'm talking about here, go to amay.tv slash shop for more information, and anything you buy via my links helps support the channel so I can buy more gear to talk to you about. And uh, can't wait to see what this does today. Oh my goodness, Ella, are you a surfer baby? He's like, Mom, it's a stand-up paddleboard, not a surfboard. Oh. This particular launch point, it's actually really great because they've got bathrooms. It's very family friendly. There's a little playground. There's a little beach area. Those who aren't kayaking or whatever can just chill here. So it's perfect for us today. Just a quick left to the left. We're lost. I thought there would be a big sign, manatees. Actually, they could be anywhere. We gotta look for them. And we're heading into the manatee zone. So I think it's roped off after a certain point, but we can go up to the ropes. So then on the other side of Three Sisters is a boardwalk where people can view from there. Wow, things just got really pretty. All right, we've paddled into Three Sister Springs and this roped off area must be where the manatees mostly hang out. Thanks, 
for paddling us. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're the best. Like that was one of the heated boat tours that you can take down here. It would be nice. You're on a heated boat tour. I am. I am on a heated boat tour. I'm a fine captain. I'm very lucky. Oh, there's my baby. Hi, Anna. I miss you, honey. That was really, really awesome. It's surprising, I'm not even that disappointed that we did not see any manatee, not even one. It's become too warm, even though it is February 17th. So what you have to do is come here between November and March, because it's winter time, and that's when the manatee come in from the ocean that's to what stay we're warm. here though, but it's, so it's unseasonably warm at the end of right. February. Although some years this would be the perfect time to do it, but this year they have already left. Check the farmer's almanac. Yeah, check the farmer's almanac. <laughs> All right, it is Sunday and we are back. We cannot get enough of Three Sister Springs. So we're heading back down so we can walk along the boardwalk and theoretically see manatee. But since we swam there yesterday, we know they aren't there, but they will be pretty. So we opted not to take the trolley. We parked right across from the visitor center and we're just gonna walk in. There's still a small fee, but the trolley would have been more, 15 bucks a person, plus we didn't want to wait for it. Without manatee, I don't even care. I found yeah. one manatee oh, in the whole spring. Oh. <laughs> and it happens to be on the billboard. <laughs> there he is. Spectacular. Look at him go. What do you think of the spring? You want to come back next year when you're bigger? And you can enjoy manatee. And now you can just enjoy your turtle. So this right here is where we swam in yesterday. So we paddleboarded park right there. Swam in here and enjoyed the springs from the water. 